What's up guys, it's Brian again from Lake Hickory Scuba and Marina and we're down here uh, still on Lake Norman. This is going to be our second treasure hunt dive of the day. Um, we're at Long Island Access. It's another public access or wildlife access. We've got one main dock out here. Not quite sure of the depth, but there's two major ramps. So we're going to have about five areas each side of the ramp and of course down at the base of the dock itself. Hopefully uh, we'll, we'll do good and find some treasure. So come along with us and see what we find.
All right, guys, so we just got finished up here at Long Island Access. As you can tell, there's quite a bit of stuff. I'm going to run you through it. Um, we got a drop cord here, probably $50 to $100 worth of drop cord there. Uh, I guarantee it's at least 100 foot long. Got a hub cap off a of car. Thankfully, we didn't find a car on this one like we did the last time. Um, got a pretty decent fishing net here. It's one of them rubber rope nets. It's not a standard net. Pretty decent net. A couple little odd and end stuff, some rod holders. Uh, bungee cord, found this 18 volt um, Dewalt flashlight, it's got a little swivel head on it. So quite a few transom mounts, got three different rod reel sets, I think a couple of them get cleaned up, they'll be in pretty good shape. Uh, this is a half set of Berkeley game shears, they'll probably get trashed. Got a lady's flip flop, she probably had a long walk home, might have walked in a circle or something, who knows, she didn't have a flip flop with her. Got a screwdriver here, get that thing cleaned up, an ultrasonic cleaner, decent screwdriver. Actually found a Zippo. I got a pretty good feeling I can get that thing cleaned up, get it refueled up, and it'll work just fine. Got a choker here, dog collar choker. A couple different anchor sets. I think one's about a 15 pound. This appears to be a homemade anchor. Uh, we'll put it to good use, trying to sink something. A couple different pairs of sunglasses here. Uh, don't really believe any of them's worth much this here is charger echoes whatever that is made in taiwan so they're probably pretty cheap got a set of aviators here that are pink i'll clean them up probably give them to my wife and of course got a cell phone here now i've actually already opened this cell phone um, it does have a card in it this is a sharp never really a sharp aqua s so but it does like i said it does have an sd card in it We'll get that guy opened up and see what's on the card. Uh, sometimes you just get a feeling that you're going to find some good stuff. I got a feeling about the, the SD card on this phone, so we'll look and see what pictures and stuff we can find on it. So, yeah, all in all, pretty decent treasure hunt. Um, this was actually our second one today, so we're going to get home, get cleaned up, get some of this stuff trashed, and just see what we can do. But, guys, I appreciate you coming on this video with us or on this dive with us as always make sure you follow us on instagram instagram and twitter like us on facebook pin us on pinterest subscribe to us here on youtube and as always guys we appreciate your business